Why, hello there. <laughs> um, today I'm doing a um, pinup look for summer. I just um, really feel in the pinup mood lately. Um, I kind of did my hair, pinup curls, and then my makeup, which I'm going to show you today. So if you're interested in how to see this look, then please stick around and I will show you how to do it. Have fun. Alrighty, so this is the look that we are going for today. It's basically just um, the basic pinup look, but it incorporates some um, pinks and some corals in it. So I think it's really fun for summer or spring. Okay, so first off, as always, start off with the primer. I'm going to be using Elf's Eyelid Primer in Pearl, and it looks just like this. It has some um, white tones in it, so it's going to really help the light colors we're going to be using. So you're just going to blend that out with your finger. And then we can, whatever it's left, we can just kind of bring it up to the brow bone. Sorry, my hair is in the way. And as always, I'm going to be using my NYX Jumbo Pencil Milk. I think it's just a habit that I use this thing because I use it like every day. But I just love it. I highly recommend getting one of them. So just blending that as usual. Now I'm going to be using my BH Cosmetics palette. This is the 120 Colors palette. And I'm going to be showing you the colors that I'm using first, um, just so I don't have to keep on pulling the thing up. So I'm using this pink color right here. And then down here, I'm going to be using this, um, wait, am I using that color? Yes. <laughs> I'm using this color, this coral color, this kind of um, burnt pink color, and then this deep orange brown color. I wish these had names, because that would be a lot easier. So now I'm just going to take a little pencil brush, looks just like this, and, oh wait, don't do that yet. We didn't even apply our base color. <laughs> so first, you want to get the first light pink I showed you. Look at me, I'm trying to get ahead of myself. So we're just going to apply this all over the eye, it's just going to be our base color. And then you bring it all the way up into the brow bone, because this will be our highlight. So just... Put all over your eye. This is what I love about pinup looks. It's so, 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 so easy. Okay, now, now you're gonna take this brush, yes, this one, and we're gonna get the um the two coral colors I showed you, the coral and the pink color, and we're just gonna put this in our crease. So start, um, kind of like find your socket like this, and then just kind of go um windshield wiper motions back and forth and kind of just blending out as you do that we just really want to make the crease um, just really stand out so just keep doing that till it's well blended and um, this little brush has a fluffy brush in the end so I'm just and my brush just broke how lovely is that? <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. So anyway, take that fluffy brush and you're just going to blend out just like that. Okay, now I'm going to try to make this stay on here. It's broken. But I'm going to get to that um, kind of burnt orange brownish color top of any excess and then um, we're just going to go ahead and put that in the um the crease as well um kind of focus more on the outer corner when you start out because you want more of that dark color in the outer corner i really like pencil brushes because it's really like okay i want the color here so i use this brush it's just really defined i love it So as you can kind of see, we're starting to get that dimension in there. You can keep adding color, kind of kind of bring it up here now. So 
you definitely just want to keep building it. That's why we start light and then work our way to dark. And I'm going to take the first color we used, that really light pink color, and just um, kind of go over the lid again. Just to brighten that up. And then you can go ahead and bring a little bit more onto your brow bone. Okay, and um, now you can take a little flat brush like this, and you can take that coral color and the burnt orange color, and then you can just put it under your eye just to give the under eye some warmth. So it don't look so like washed out. Now, if you find my stuff, we're just going to get a um, black eyeliner and tight liner eye as usual. Just like so. And then I'm going to use my Maybelline Line Stiletto liquid eyeliner, which is my favorite, and I'm going to line my eye. Basic pinup look, it's just the cat eye winged out eyeliner. So we're going to start in the middle of our eye and just do little strokes and go out, bring it in. We want the inner corner to be um, kind of thinner, so just be really careful when you do this. I'm going to zoom in so you can see a little bit better of what exactly is going on. I don't even know if that helped. So you want to like, this line right here will be kind of straight and then you curve with your eye shape. That's kind of look we're going for. And then once it looks like that, we're ready to add the wing. So where the end of your eye is, like right here, you want to draw that wing going up. So you can bring it in like this. It's easier to go in than out because you'll get a thinner line, which is what we want. It definitely takes practice to do um, this. Once you learn how to do it, it's super de duper easy. I do it like every day. <laughs> so now I'm just going to curl my eyelashes. For about 10 seconds or so. Okay. And now I'm going to be using three different kinds of um, mascaras. I'm going to be using Maybelline Colossal, which is my favorite. Um, the Too Faced Lashgasm. And the Legal Length um, by Maybelline. And I'm going to do one coat of each and I'm not going to put on the bottom eyelashes but I'm going to go play that and I'll be right back. Alrighty, I am back with eyelashes now. Now I'm going to show you what I use um, for the cheeks. I use Elf's Pink Passion. I'm just going to take that on a um, blush brush and just lightly dust it onto your cheeks. We don't want too much because um, a lot of pinup looks don't um, involve that much blush. So we just want to kind of a uh, really nice natural look and a really matte face. Um, oops, I have a little something right there. It won't come off. Come on, little guy. Well, that just bothered me. Okay, so... Um, yeah, now lips. I'm going to be using baby lips. I drop everything, I swear. So, I'm going to be using baby lips by Maybelline. And this is just um, to prep our lips for the lip liner. Just so it'll go on easier. You can use any kind of chapstick, it doesn't matter. And I'm using Wet n Wild Fabusha Lip Liner. And just basic line your lips. Is my cell phone going off? If you hear that, I'm sorry. The chastic really, really makes this go on it's so much easier. Sorry, 
sorry, my cat is like freaking out. I don't know what's going on with her. So once you just get a um, an even color all over, I'm gonna take my Too Faced Glamour Gloss in the color Flirt. Looks just like that. And we're just gonna put that on top. You wanna focus more in the center of the lips. It's kinda more like a two-tone kind of lip color. And then on the top. This lip gloss seriously smells amazing. It smells like birthday cake and like hot chocolate. It's just all goodness wrapped in one. So this is the finished look. It's um, very classic, but I think it's really fun for summer, especially if you're into a little pinup look. So I hope you guys tried this out. Let me know if you do. And if you have any more requests, let me know down there. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.